Today, forensic experts are testifying in the trial involving a Raleigh man who was killed while trying to sell his SUV on Craigslist. Prosecutors argue Andy Banks was senselessly killed in September 2020. The defense team admits Justin Merritt pulled the trigger. WRL's Chelsea Donovan is live at the Wake County Justice Center with what we have learned from today's testimony. Chelsea. Jeff, the ninth witness for the state took the stand today in day two of this testimony, a forensic expert that testified for more than an hour about blood, bullets, and cleaning supplies inside that 2010 Range Rover that Andy Banks had intended to sell to Justin Merritt before he was shot and killed. Now, you can see evidence of blood and bullet holes inside the Range Rover shown in, shown in court today, one that Banks listed for $15,000 and had met with Justin Merritt of Danville, Virginia, in the Village District in September of 2020 to sell. Banks was never seen again after that meeting. His body later found in a rural field in Virginia. Merritt admitted to shooting and killing Banks, but his defense attorney says the murder was not premeditated. Today, the forensic expert testified there was a tremendous amount of blood splattering and bullet holes in that Range Rover, as well as a lot of different cleaning supplies. Now, the state says Banks was shot more than five times in the back. Here you can see a red raincoat he was last wearing filled with bullet holes and blood. This is the inside of the hood of the rain jacket where you can see red and color stains. We removed the weather stripping and found this projectile lodged into that A-frame. When you say projectile, is that what you believe to be a, a bullet? Yes. Or the spent part of a bullet? Correct, yes. Now, there's a chance that the state could wrap up their case late this afternoon or tomorrow. Merritt is not expected to take the stand in his defense. A fingerprint expert, the 11th witness, actually is currently on the stand with the medical examiner expected to testify late this afternoon. If convicted of this murder, Merritt will automatically receive a life sentence in prison. Jeff. Chelsea Donovan with those details from the Wake County Justice Center this noon. Chelsea, thank you.